okay so I've run about 45 minutes the gym is like 0.6 miles away and I had to stop like three times my calf just filled out of blood I don't know if you ever got that when you run a lot I just like I was kept trying to I stopped and kept trying to run stopped kept running around but I was like my calves they were just like Whoo! no so I'm walking a little bit hopefully I can run a little bit more so it's 8 o'clock now I left about 4 by 7 that was good that was good I can run it in Thailand. I feel like there's nothing like it. Alright, the gym's 0.4 miles away, about 10 minutes. Fuck you, Cass. Let's fucking do this. Ah, yes. There we go. I made it. First session done. Wicked. Even though I had a week off, I can feel that I'm getting better. Today I chose a pace, like a speed and a power that I could do for the whole time. And it worked. And it, it was good. So I can feel myself getting better. Um, so consistency is key with everything. Yeah, so I'm looking forward to going to the gym later. A couple of hours, do some stretch training, do a leg. I'll film it for you guys. Uh, upper leg, upper I mean a lot of body shrimp day, so see you soon. Okay, sweet and sour chicken done. Got my iced tea. Gotta go to gym in a minute. It's about half hour actually. It's some leg training. I'm here at uh, Rawai Gym and Fitness again. I'm gonna sign up for three months, which is a little bit cheaper. 3,300 bucks. And um, yeah, just gonna get on it. So today I'm gonna do a leg session. Uh, it's for Muay Thai, so gonna help my fighting um, I might put the well I will put the full video up it will either be before this or it'll be after this video I am decided yet so that's what I'm gonna do now Morning, it's Tuesday today, so I thought I'd change it up a bit. Instead of going Muay Thai this morning and gym um, in the afternoon, I'm gonna go gym now and Muay Thai in the afternoon. So now I'm gonna do sprints and core.
showered, kicked my fluorescent green shorts. Muay Thai, Muay Thai. So yeah, 200 knees and 200 teeps until the trainer told me that I need to get my hips into the teeps. So next time, as soon as I did five, I was like, wow, that, that's a big difference. So yeah. Anyway, second session done. Now to eat, sleep, get ready, get home, <laughs> talk, get ready for tomorrow. So, and food. It's 9:45. I feel battered, which is wicked, but I'm still on it. So I'm up at six tomorrow. So if you're still watching this, see you tomorrow. And just like that, it's six o'clock. Yes, morning blender. Let's go. Three seven miles, I think, in eight point three seven. I mean, thirty seven point five minutes. gym for upper body. So too much sleep is not good. I went to bed at nine o'clock and woke up now and it's 10 o'clock. I'm meant to be up at six. Okay, so wait till later then, not in the morning and I'm meant to do legs today, lower body, or I might go for a run. I'm not sure, I need to have breakfast inside. Hmm. Legs.
can't be bothered to go to the gym. But then I thought, if we only train where we wanted to, then we never get anywhere. done did clinch as well but I didn't film it because I put my phone away I didn't know we were carrying on so that's today's training done now we're gonna go see Martina in Paton cleaning a fight which is in about two hours so that'll be good <laughs> My goal was to get in fight in two weeks. He hasn't been said to want to fight. I spoke to a guy, sorted it out, and I got to fight in two weeks for a belt. The 16th, so. <laughs> so here I'm from Boxing, so yeah, I got to fight. So two weeks. Get the training in. I must have manifested that shit, but I'm so happy, so excited. I love this stadium, so. So Martina smashed it. She didn't get a win, but she smashed it like I knew she would. Um, it's about 1 30 now. I don't think I'm getting up tomorrow at 6 o'clock for training. Um, so probably just gonna get up about 10 and go gym so change up my training slightly because of the fight it's coming in two weeks and um, yeah that's me and just like that it's morning so I was just about to go out and you know what I'm not lying I'm feeling tired I was like oh, I can't be fucked but I was like that's not the attitude when you got a fight coming like I said you can't train when you feel good you got to train when you don't feel good and you can't be fucked you got to train and then sometimes a year best session. So I thought I'd have a coconut, get some eggs, and then go do some sprints. About four miles, we'll do some editing while I'm here. All right, so I was sitting here thinking, you know what, I can't be fucked to train, but I've got to because I'm filming for YouTube, everyone's gonna see, and like, you know, I've got a fight coming, so I've got to. And I was like, maybe I can just film and say, hey, I forgot my phone, I just did some training. I was like, you know what, fuck it. I'm just gonna say, I'm tired. And it's 12 o'clock now, and I'm training Muay Thai at 4, at 3.30 actually, to do my half hour run and then two hour session. So I was like, it's fine. You can, you, you can, you've got to know the difference. When you train, everyone's different. You've got to know the difference between being lazy and actually being tired. Like, did I mention I'm 37 and I've trained like eight times already this week? No, I'm joking. Age is nothing.
you're never ever going to walk out training really bad. But when you feel like shit and you can't bother to train, just train. Because you're going to feel great. It's true. It's amazing. So I'm so happy I went to that Feel so this is my last weekly meal. Chicken, vegetables, I had chips, I gotta have it. I haven't had it since I've been here. And my favorite, frozen roses and water. So it's morning and I'm um, going for my long run. So a lot of us run at our own speed, so I can just run on my own, which is wicked. So that's what I'm gonna do. Last week, it's still seen a half kilometers of Martina. This week, who knows what I'm gonna do. Miles at 10k, that hour and five minutes. I feel good. I feel like I could do some more. That's done. That's the last one of the week. Good. Okay, so we did sparring, clinch sparring. This is meant to be on there. I fell again and broke, kept feeling and broke. I couldn't even film it. This, but that's the last session. A good session, last finished. Rest tomorrow. I feel fucking amazing. I feel like I could go round after round after round. One week of full training. I fucking loved it. Ready to fight now. Okay, so. It's the end of the week. I'm so happy we've had Dora. You can say whatever you want. Yeah, she said something and now. Yeah. So this is Jasmine, Martina, Jonathan. They all beat me up. But it's the end of the week. Wicked trainer. Now we're here to, at this place called Wee Cafe. Nice fancy drink here. 
I don't know, I forgot what's in it, it's so fancy. So this is what they got. This is a video by the way. <laughs> oh, okay. That's good. And uh, they got, look at that lovely food. Wanna pose as well? <laughs> and this is, um, uh, this is Jonathan's food. This is my food. Chicken burger and chips. So, now, this is rest day, Sunday, relaxing, ready for <laughs> Monday's training, and this is what I'm doing at Patong Peak. Just chilling, watching people be crazy on their jet skis, <laughs> and then get ready for Monday's training. So, feeling good, feel amazing. Take care.